Here's how to assume you already have your desire. Check this out. And this is a perfect example. Neville Goddard tells a story of a lady named Anne from New York City. She was a friend of his who attended all of his meetings. Anyway, one time she brought up to Neville that she would love a new hat. And Neville said, all right, you have a new hat. Put it on. What hat do you want? And she didn't know at the moment. She just wanted a new hat. And Neville's like, all right, put it on. Wear it. Just as though it were true. Some time passed and she said to Neville, you know, the strangest thing happened. You told me that I could have anything I wanted if I simply imagined it. Here's what happened to her. One day, she saw a beautiful hat in the window of a department store on Broadway and fell in love with it. But it cost around $17.50, which was pretty up there back in the day. But she really wanted it and remembered what Neville told her. So here's what she did. Ready? In her imagination, she placed the hat on her head. She mentally put it on and felt herself wearing it as she walked up Broadway and felt the thrill of it. And as she walked back, and this is smart, she didn't look into the store windows. Why? Because if she saw her reflection without the new hat on her head, it would throw her off, right? She'd get disappointed. And when she got home, same thing. She imagined taking off the hat and placing it on the top shelf before looking in the mirror. And went sound asleep in the belief that her new lovely hat was up there. And every day as she put on her old hat, she imagined it was the new one. Ten days later, a friend called her up, inviting her to lunch. And when she got there, the friend handed her a hat box and said, Anne, I don't want to offend you. I must have been insane when I bought this hat. I wouldn't wear it to a dogfight. Yet strangely enough, I think it would look lovely on you. She opened the box, reached in, and brought out not a hat, but the hat. The same hat she had seen in the window and had worn in her imagination. Boom. Coincidence? Would it happen anyway? I don't think so. Look, there are no accidents in this world. No matter how small they seem, all things have causes. So how'd she do it again? Assumption. She wanted a hat. She mentally put it on, felt the reality of it. Then bam, someone bought it and gave it to her. Just like that. She didn't even pay a dime. You know what I'm saying? Okay, the point, in short, if you can feel it, you can have it. Straight up. That's the secret. The feeling. Try this today. Know what you want and assume it. Live as though it were true. Imagine feeling the money in your hands, seeing the inside of your new home, hearing the voice of your doctor telling you that a miracle has happened. Anything. Don't worry about the how or the process. None of that. Just fall asleep in the belief that it's already yours, that you already have it. Then just watch. As Neville says, for an assumption, though false, if persisted in, will harden into fact because you get what you believe. Yeah. All right, if you appreciate this video, hit that like and subscribe button and that bell to help support my channel. And if you're ready to live the life you really want, then yo, click the link below to learn more about Law of Assumption Mastery, how to manifest anything the Neville Goddard way. Like I always say, more's coming. Till next time, I'm out. Peace.